Hello everyone, welcome back to Cyber Platter. In this video, we'll explore the important concepts of access management. Today we'll cover what is identity, authentication, and authorization. Now let's talk about identity. Identity refers to the unique characteristics that distinguish an individual. In the digital world, we call this a digital identity. Just like how people are recognized by their names, role numbers, or employee numbers, a digital identity represents you online. Let's say you have booked a flight and you arrived at the airport. The security personnel will ask you to show boarding pass. And the boarding pass contains your name. In this case, your name serves as your identity. In the digital world, your email ID, user ID, account number, etc. serves as your identity. Hope you understand what is identity. Now let's see what is authentication. Authentication is the process of proving who you say you are. That means the process of proving that identity actually belongs to you. In our previous example, once the boarding pass is verified, Security person will ask you to show some government issued identity cards such as passport, driver's license, uh, voter ID, etc. This government issued ID proves that the identity belongs to you and the verification process is called authentication. In the digital world, authentication happens by validating your user ID with your password our one-time passcode. Once the authentication is complete, we move on to authorization. Authorization decides what you can or cannot do. Going back to our flight example, just because you have a valid flight ticket doesn't mean you can access restricted areas like the cockpit. Only authorized personnel like pilots can enter. In the digital world, having a valid user ID and password doesn't give you unlimited access. Different users have different type or different level of authorization. For example, a database admin can perform admin tasks while other users have limited permissions. So only who has admin rights can perform admin tasks. So that is called authorization. I hope this video helped you to understand the basics of identity, authentication and authorization. If you found it helpful, please like, comment, share and subscribe to Cyber Platter. Stay tuned for more videos. See you soon. Bye.